counties. This is the 12th Annual Hastings Sings, sponsored by the Hastings Chamber of Commerce and Tourism Bureau, the Hastings Science Club, and Experience Shows Incorporated. And now, please welcome to the stage your master of ceremonies, my dad, here is Chuck Scavin. Hello, 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 and welcome to the final day of Hastings Rivertown Days 2021. It's great to have you here. And we're going to try to move around because, I mean, move along, I should say, because it's a little bit hot out there. And uh, actually, there might be a few seats down here in the shade if you get too hot. Come on down and uh, enjoy the show from, from behind everybody. My name is Chuck Spavin. It's great to be here with the finals of Hastings Sings. We had 15 people, 15 people audition. And what you're going to hear today is eight people. And then there was one that submitted a video submission video because of a work obligation she could not be here and the judges have already seen that video submission and uh, so they're ready so with that I'm going to introduce our judges because uh, we have a couple really really great judges here this afternoon and we got them out of the sun which is even better right so uh, Barbara F Fortune when you raise your hand there she is from Cottage Grove Minnesota professional music educator and musician who has worked with student musicians from early childhood to adult. Since retiring from full-time teaching, Barbara is frequently called on for educating music festivals for both vocal and instrumental solo and ensemble performers, and as a guest clinician for choirs. For choirs excuse me. Barb has been a professional church musician since high school, having served several congregations of various denominations, and currently she is serving as worship music director at Amazing Grace Lutheran Church in Invergrove Heights. Please give her a nice Hastings welcome. All right, and sitting next to her is Josh Edom. He, uh, Josh has performed at the Guthrie Theater, was a multi-year winner, multi-year winner of Eden Prairie Sings, and also a finalist in Minnesota Sings. He was trained at Lawrence University, the bass section leader there, and, and at St. Anthrew, St. Anthrew Lutheran uh, in Eden Prairie, and a Zoltate Chamber Choir. Please give him a nice welcome. All right, well, some of you are probably wondering, you know, what happens after Hastings Sings? Well, the people that win Hastings Sings, the top two winners from each division, and there's a 13 to 20 year old division, and then a 21 and older division, those four people move on and have the honor of representing Hastings at Minnesota Sings, which will be happening here in October, not here, in Woodbury, excuse me, uh, in October, October 16th and 17th will be the finals of Minnesota Sings, and there they will compete against singers from all around our great state. And uh, give you a little bit of uh, background on Minnesota Sings, the first year Minnesota Sings happened, the, 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 the payout was $300 to the winners, all right? I'm pleased to tell you that our total payout this year, including what we give to charity and to uh, sponsors, our total payout is 20,000. So if you make it to Minnesota Sings, you got a good chance of winning some serious money. But in addition to the money, there's a lot more. The top three winners, the three, first, second, and third place winners win recording sessions at the garage, which is a great facility in Burnsville. The garage uh, has a, just a wonderful facility there, uh, and they win recording sessions, all three. So a total of six people will win recording sessions there. In addition to that, they win an electric voice microphone. And that's what I'm talking on right now, is an electric voice brand microphone based out in Burnsville and uh, distributed around the world. And we want to thank Electric Voice, by the way, for their sponsorship. And then they also get music gear from a couple other of our sponsors, Gator, uh, Cases and Stands, and also from Mackey Mixers. So those are our corporate sponsors. But our platinum sponsor is the person or the company that gives away most of the prize money. And please give an ace round of applause for our platinum sponsor, because they've been there since day one. And that's RBC Wealth Management, based in the Twin Cities here. Give them an ace round of applause. Thank you. All right, so uh, the four winners here will be going on to Woodbury. They'll be there October 16th and 17th. I know they'd love to have you cheer them on. 
because they'll be uh, singing against other winners from around state uh, events. So what we call local sings events. So this what this is right now is called a local sings events, and there's been quite a few already here in Minnesota, and then a lot more coming up, and it's a lot of fun. If you get a chance to attend a local sings event, other than Hastings, uh, you know, go go listen to them because these kids and adults need the support. Once again, two divisions, 13 to 20 year olds and 21 and older, all right? So with that, we've introduced the judges. You kind of know what the format is here. And a lot of these people, uh, some of these people have performed before in Hastings Sings. Haven't, some of them haven't performed. So I want you to give them all a great big round of applause. Our first contestant today is Ella Kimmon. Tell us a little bit about yourself first before you sing. Um, <laughs> I like to sing, and yeah, I don't know. <laughs> All right, here we go with Ella.
Rosella Kibben. All right. So we're going to do the 13 to 20 year old division first, and then we'll do the 21s after that, 21 and older after that. So next up on the schedule here, please give a nice Hastings welcome to Aubrey Bangin. Aubrey, tell us a little bit about yourself real quick. Um, I'm Aubrey, I'm 17, and I love to sing. <laughs> All right, well, that's a good summary. All right, here we go. To the backpacked, first love leader, the heart cracked, double down dreamer, the homesick, the grass that's greener, and a slice of mama's peach pie. To the flat broke, couch cushion gas money, the worker bee that ain't getting no honey, missing someone all the while running, gunning for the brighter lights. Here's to the breakups, that didn't break us, the breakdown won't turn the tape shut. To a little dive bar in the lawn of color, you're a song from a band that saves you, man, when it's hitting rock bottom, smoke them. Making the best of the worst day kind of night. We've all got a number, and we don't want a drunk dial. A good friend we ain't seen in a while. And a slow dance lifting these boots, and a chance of putting down new. Tell us a little bit about yourself. My name's Eva. I'm 19 years old, and believe it or not, I love to sing too. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here's Eva. Shoes in this apron. 
that place and its patrons have taken more than I gave them. It's not easy to know I'm not anything like I used to be, although it's true. I was never attention sweet centered. I still Eva Starkan. All right, we're moving right along here. Also, I'd like to remind you that uh, when we finish here, you can probably go out and catch some more of the car show. The car show goes till 4 p.m. And of course, we've got all our food vendors and our beverage vendors vendors going. So, help yourself to some some good food and some cool beverages on a hot day here. All right, coming up next, please give a nice Hastings welcome to Isabel Ebling. Isabel, tell us a little bit about something yourself. Um, my name is Isabel. I'm 15. Um, I like to sing. <laughs> I'm just waiting for one to get up there and say, I really don't like to sing. But uh... <laughs> All right. All right. What are you going to sing for us? Um, 
sign of the times. Isabel Ebling. All right. Well, we got one more here in the 13 to 20 year old division. And our first guy. Give him a nice round of applause. That's Nathan Schindler. You're the first guy to see. <laughs> well, there were some more in the auditions, but you're the first one to make it to the finals. So, so Nathan, I want to ask you. Uh, uh, can you handle all those girls over there? Women? I got it. I got it. Yeah, all right. Okay. <laughs> all right, what do you got to sing, Nathan? Uh, Heard Me Once by Ben Platt. All right. Here's Nathan Schindler. Call out 
outside It seems, it seems that I forgot just how to read your face But I know you too well to get it wrong If you have to hurt Decided on you If you keep it going Then one by one the memories will start to blur You ruin the good ones But I guess my photo album's none of your concern Nothing kind about a hundred small betrayals If you love me at all I Kill it now If you have to hurt Decided on you. I've decided on you. And if I'm disappointed, it's cause you're not the person I knew. If I had it my way, I'd be kinder than you. I'm sure I'll forgive you soon. Decided on you. All right, folks, so that's the 13 to 20 year olds. Let's give them all a nice round of applause, please. As I mentioned, we had about 15 people audition, so we got it down to those that you just heard this afternoon. All right, we're going to move now into the 21 and older division, 21 and older division. And the first person up that I want you to give a nice round of applause to, her name is Casey Levine. So, uh, Casey, uh, tell us a little bit about yourself. Um, I, my name is Casey. I just moved to Hastings actually in September, so I'm really excited to be here. Um, I love singing as well. It's a form of self-care for me. I will be singing um, a song, my favorite song. It's called the MLK song, Up to the Mountain. It's really powerful. It's based on Martin Luther King Jr.'s last speech, Up to the Mountain. All right, here's Casey. Yeah. 
All right. Moving right on. Hey, I do want to mention that uh, after we finish, we've got two more singers for you, and then we're going to turn it over to the judges. And we've got a special treat for you while the judges are adjudicating. Uh, one of the winners from Minnesota Sings last year is going to sing for you. So, uh, and in addition to that, we're going to try to give away some gift cards. Who wants to win a gift card? Yeah, such enthusiasm. <laughs> no, we, we're going to give away some gift cards. Thanks to our good people at Lock and Dam. Lock and Dam, all right? So if you like to eat at Lock and Dam, you're going to want to try to win one of these gift cards. But first, we got to finish up with our singers here. So next up, please give an ace Hastings welcome to Maria Ramos. How's Maria? Oh, hanging in there, you know. Oh, well, good, good. Tell us a little bit about yourself. Um, well, I've lived in Hastings since I was about 10, um, I've always loved to sing, and I've actually competed in Hastings Sings since it began, before Minnesota Sings was a thing. Um, usually I'm more prepared than I was this, this year, but you know, I just figured it's fun anyways, and it's always a great experience, right. no matter what. What are you going to sing for us? Um, I plan on singing Rise Up by Andrew Day. Maria Ramos. Thank you. Broken down and tired, living life on a merry-go-round. You can't find the lighter, but I see it in you, so we'll walk it out. Ooh, mountains, we can walk it out in mountains. And I'll rise up, I'll rise like the day, I'll rise up, I'll rise not afraid, I'll rise up, and I'll do it a thousand times again.
live contestant here. here. Please give a nice Hasey's welcome to Morgan Fortier. <laughs> Morgan, what are you going to sing for us? I'm going to sing Wherever You Will Go by The Calling. All right, Morgan. Morgan Fournier. All right, so uh, you heard everybody. Let's give them a great big round of applause, ladies and gentlemen. And as I promised, you've got a very special treat here, and then we're going to uh, try to give away some gift cards, and then she's going to sing one more, and by then, the judges will announce the winners of the 2021 Hastings Sings, and they will move on, four of them, so the top two from each division will move on to represent Hastings at Minnesota Sings, which is coming up October 16th and 17th out in Woodbury at the Courtyard Marriott there on 94 and uh, Radio Drive. And uh, I'm just waiting for a cue from, excuse me? Are you ready there with the iPad? I am. All right, very good. Ladies and gentlemen, one of the winners from Minnesota Sings last year 
Please give a nice Hastings welcome to Beth Brennan. Well, hello. So uh, last year you were a winner. Yep. All right. Tell us a little bit about yourself. Uh, my name is Beth Brennan. I'm originally from Aiken, Minnesota. I live right now in Eden Prairie. I also sing lead in a band called Sugar Buzz. We just played last night at Petey Pappy's up the street. So <laughs> we'll see how my vocal care is today. <laughs> yeah, you know, and, and I'm glad you brought that up because one of the questions we always get is, you know, are, are these singers amateurs or are they professionals? And the way we define a professional is if more than... 25% of your income, of your 2020 income, if more than 25% of it came from singing, then we consider you to be a professional and you're not eligible to compete in Minnesota Sings. Um, and I pay more than I make, so <laughs> I have to have a day job. Yeah. All right, ladies and gentlemen, Beth Brennan. That's <laughs>
percent, but thank you for indulging me. I'm trying to hold my breath, let it stay this way. Can't let this moment end. You set off the dream with me, getting loud now. Can you hear it echo? Will you share this with me? Cause darling, without you All the shine of a thousand spotlights All the stars we steal from the night sky Will never be enough Never be enough Towers of gold are still too little These We've got the winners here, and thanks again once again to our two judges, Barbara Fortune and Joshua Edom. Give them an ace round of applause again, please. All right, I'm going to start with the 13 to 20 year olds, and these two people will go on. They'll have the honor of representing Hastings at Minnesota Sings, which will be happening October 16th and 17th, and I know they would love to have you come out and support them at that event. It's a two-day event. So, scoring second, scoring second, with a score of 172, Eva Storkamp! All right. Okay, and scoring first, this was pretty close, wasn't it? And a close competition. With a score of 181, please give a nice round of applause to Nathan Schindler. So we got our two 13 to 20 year old division winners that will be moving on to represent Hastings at Minnesota Saints. All right, so now we move into the 21 and older division. 21 and older division. And scoring second 
was the person that submitted the video submission, video submission, and her name is Wendy Gobrich. Give her a nice round of applause. I know she's not here, but give her a nice round of applause. So Wendy uh, scored one. She scored 155. 155, all right? And our first place winner with a score of 156. Please give a nice round of applause to Casey Labine. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I want to thank all of you for attending, and I want to thank all of the contestants that participated in Hastings Sings. It's been a great year. Thank you.